Folks, the story of America is a story of progress and resilience. Of always moving forward, of never, ever giving up. It's a story unique among all nations. Somebody get him some water, please. <coughs> what did he just say? What's up, guys? Your boy, Benny. If you are going to meet the most powerful man in the world, the most famous man to live, the best memer of all time, you better come correct, ladies and gentlemen. We were able to hang out with Donald Trump this past weekend. What did we talk with Donald Trump about? Uh, I did this motion to Donald Trump for a very specific reason. Obviously, I wanted to talk to Donald Trump about his memes, specifically about his trolling. Ladies and gentlemen, the reason I did this hand motion is because this is the hand motion that Donald Trump did on stage when talking about Big Fanny Willis and her lover, Nathan's Hot Dog. Dated by Fanny in Georgia. Fanny. How did that work out? And her lover, Nathan Wade. And they hired him for almost a million dollars because of his great, great experience. Of course, he didn't have any experience. He had experience in something else. You know that. <laughs> a lot of experience. It, get, it gets me every time. Donald Trump, look at, the, look at the hand motion. Am I the only one who appreciates this kind of stuff? <laughs> you see the hand motion? So this, ladies and gentlemen, is why, of course, that that hand motion is is why I well did this with Donald Trump <laughs> and he was laughing. Look at him laugh. <laughs> oh, we have so much fun on this program. I brought that up. You know, you don't get a lot of time. You don't want to monopolize the guy's time. You don't want to talk too long. I asked him about Joe Biden. I asked him about the State of the Union. I asked him about Fannie Willis. You want to talk about things that Donald Trump clearly like, truly likes talking about, and. Donald Trump clearly likes trolling people. He likes memes. Donald Trump, of course, uh, once during a um, cabinet meeting, displayed a giant meme, a Game of Thrones meme. Look at it. Sanctions are coming in November. This is what Donald Trump had on the table during a cabinet meeting. <laughs> we, we didn't deserve him. Ladies and gentlemen, look at this. That's so good. <laughs> so Donald Trump's always been a major appreciator of memes. I wanted to speak with Donald Trump about memes. And I also wanted to speak with him about Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Donald Trump told me that Joe Biden was on drugs at the State of the Union. And then Donald Trump goes ahead and posts an incredible State of the Union meme. Did we inspire this? I don't know, ladies and gentlemen. But we did talk to Donald Trump about his memes and about State of the Union. And so, well, here it is. Hello, Americans. Here's the simple truth. Look at the chaos. End it now. The President I, of the United, United States. State of the Union 2024. Yeah, baby. Donald Trump posted this on his Truth Social. Oh, that one is so good. That is got that is certainly one of my all-time favorites. Again, ladies and gentlemen, if you follow Donald Trump closely, you'll realize he is a deep appreciator of memes. And if you speak with Donald Trump privately, you should bring up those memes because Donald Trump does quite literally uh, consume the memes that are made about him loves to post the memes that are made about him. He is a master troller. Even during his speeches, he brings up famous memes. You remember the screaming liberal? <gasps> no! When Donald Trump's inaugurated? They have a smattering of people. Oh, good luck. Remember Hillary with the uh, thing with the women screaming? The way, that one, one woman with the glasses, she's become famous? No, no. <laughs> and Donald J. Trump is now president of the United States. Oh, yeah. It's been a great honor to be able to introduce for the first time ever. So Donald Trump 
trolling his way through the 2024 election cycle. Is that 2016 energy all over again? Donald Trump's lover of memes. All right, we know this for sure. This is uh, something that Donald Trump posted during the State of the Union. I cannot believe this was on President Trump's Instagram. Look at Kamala, the video. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> buy American. We're going to buy America. Oh, so trade rules. Buy America has been the law since 1933. <laughs> no word yet on that. This is a filter on Kamala. No word yet. We don't know. We don't know. Donald Trump loves trolling. Donald Trump has posted many, many funny things on his social media. We spent the weekend actually uh, at a Trump property in Doral that has a, a golf course at it. Donald Trump loves golfing, and Donald Trump loved posting this meme when Joe Biden fell down. Oh, yes, baby. Donald Trump has no chill. No chill. Donald Trump posting this meme, putting all of these memes up. It was not even a half an hour that Biden wobbled down the stairs of the plane. Uh, and Donald and Donald Trump posted this, getting hit by the golf balls four times. So he's a lover of humor. He's obviously a lover of people having a bit of a laugh. Donald Trump has often used memes and uses memes to troll on Truth Social. Biden's campaign launched a Truth Social account. Their first day on Truth Social, they saw this meme. Border security will work for food. Problem solved. <laughs> you enjoying? You enjoying Truth Social? Biden campaign? Donald Trump posts mugshot meme with guns pointed at him. With all the people never surrender. Donald Trump. United we stand. All the people. Fascists. Antifa. Fake news. This is a John Wick meme. You know, this is John. John. There's a John Wick poster, right? So that's extremely based. And so is this. All of it just makes Trump look more bad. And um, all of it creates more entertaining content. And we are totally and completely entertained. It is very entertaining. And Donald Trump's an entertaining guy. And so, ladies and gentlemen, um, roll on, Donald Trump. This is our favorite, maybe our favorite meme that are posted. The uh, earpiece guy. The earpiece in Joe Biden's ear. Donald Trump making regularly making fun, savage fun of Joe Biden and his decaying health and his decaying age and his drug use. And ladies and gentlemen, um, this is no exception. Please enjoy. All right, Joe, let's see if you can even get to the damn mark this time. Remember, like we practice, walk around, go up and say hi to the general and then get behind the podium. Yep, up the stairs, careful, careful. You know how you are with stairs. Yeah, okay, that podium, yes. Walk forward, walk forward, say hi to the general, and stop. And stop. Where, where are you go? Not that general, oh my God. Joe, go back to the podium. Joe, oh my God, this is so awkward. These poor cadets. Joe, to the podium, could you, yeah, thank you. Direct him to the podium, please. Come on. There you go, old man. Get up there. No, the podium, you idiot. Where are you going? Oh, God. You know, I hope something happens to you later. A few moments later. All right, go ahead and walk off the stage now, Joe. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What happened? Did someone push you? Invisible stairs? Where? There's nothing there, Joe. 